right, boys. And probably one girl, maybe. Time to put the dart back together. It is miserably hot out here. Took us four weeks, but we got the head back. Here she be. Head's back. Time to slap her back together. Learned my lesson with valves. Gonna do those a little bit for it this time. So yeah. I'm gonna throw a GoPro. Like right here maybe. So you guys can see what kind of BS I gotta deal with. Nah. We'll see what we can do here. So yeah. Hopefully you guys like the time-lapse music that I have chosen. Here we go. Well, the head's on! Pressure tested okay. I think my tester's a piece of shit. But I got that cylinder to pressure test pretty good, so we're going to let her off. I think we're going to go inside. It's raining quite hard. On the next yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, so we literally got rained out yesterday. It from the shop to the house. All of us were completely soaked. I thought I was drowning my one kid running through the rain. She was literally acting like she was drowning. Took the shop today. He'll be alright. Always figures. The one damn light bulb I need burn out. But, look at this, we got a motor again. Heads on, everything pressure tested pretty good. My pressure tester's a piece of crap, so we're just gonna bolt it together and let her buck. I gotta remember what I did here. I cut these lines. They're both black. No, they're not, one's red, okay. Oh, damn it. Keep forgetting to get a dipstick tube. Anyway, we got a little change. This is on. That's much better than it was before. So yeah, we're gonna start bolting together. Nova. Just keeping everybody involved. She's got her shoes on. Well, I see one kid. I don't see the little one. Oh, she's under the chair. Hey, Nova Lynn. What are you doing? What are you doing? You playing in the oil dry? All right, whatever. Hey, Harley. What you doing? You playing in the rocks? Oh, you got the, what do you got? You got the Jags paper? All right, here's how we're coming so far. This is a pain in the ass to get on here. But I tried putting the water pump on first. That don't work. So now we're cleaning that. Then we'll get the water pump on, bolt that in. So I can start curing. Um, I forgot about putting the little plate on behind that, but we got that, so we're good now. We good. I RTV'd the bejesus out of this thing, so hopefully it don't leak. Probably will. Don't care. Pretty much over it at this point. I don't even know what the hell that is. I still don't care. Valve train's next once we get the water pump on. Yeah. Hopefully this thing gets going next day or so. Alright, we've lashed most of them. Here, let me just get that out of the way for you. <laughs> She's gonna last the last two, and then I'll check it. You don't want it super, super, super tight. You want to get it like tight and then back it off a little. You know what I mean? Yeah. Know what I'm saying? I'm learning as we go here, but she's out here helping, so. Okay. So we'll run the nut down. I'm learning this off of YouTube and calling upon the wise old men that I know. Look at you. Fancy pants. So then you wanna hold this. Don't let this twist. So you like it there. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Knuckle buster. Now Let me see the feeler gauge. It just feels a little looser than what I've been doing. Mm. 
It ain't too bad. We'll, we'll leave it. Now we gotta. No, because if that's the one that fucking breaks. <laughs> if it breaks, then you get to buy the new Hemi. No. We're doing a big boy. So now we gotta take our Wilchum collar here and turn it. Oh gosh. The flies are so bad. She's even taking a chance of whooping the baby with the fly swatter. They've been really getting him. So, once the exhaust starts opening, you do the intake. So that's the, we just did the... Exhaust. Okay. So now we gotta turn it until the exhaust starts opening. And then the intake one should be at the top and we'll gap it. This is painful. And if I do it wrong, I'm gonna bend all these push rods and I'll be so fucking mad. But learning, sorry. So forking mad. The wife says it's good to go. Nah. <laughs> They're all last. 18 on the exhaust. 0 .08, 0 .018 on the exhaust. What the f He's a good boy. And .016 on the intake. Per the cam card. Maybe we slap a intake on it. We gotta get a water pump done. Fuel system, distributor, spark plugs and wires. You know, the whole thing. But the heads on the intake or the valves are all done. Drive train is, or the valve train is on. Timing cover's on. Yeah, we're getting there. It'll be done tomorrow for sure if I don't work late tonight. So we'll get All right, guys. So we just went in over under power. Push rods. Everything looks good. Nothing bent. Nothing super loose. There's no compression on the motor because there's no spark plugs. But last time I did it, it bent without that. So, yeah. I'm confident enough to put her together. Cards on it, obviously. I just got to bolt it down. Put the fuel system back on. Coil, spark plugs need to get gap and plug it in. Then we can start it. Um, probably wait to hook up all the other shit until I get it started. Um, we'll figure this out. But Quick shout out, y'all. I'm finishing this up. Thanks, mom, for the badass light. I don't have to use my Milwaukee anymore. I can actually see. So yeah, thank you. Yeah, S10 is a goat house, goat playhouse. Bastards. All right, we're almost done here. Intakes bolted on. Harley, get your fingers out of the fan, you crazy goober. I gotta bolt the exhaust up, which I found all but one bolt for. Um, then we got to gap spark plugs, put the distributor on, run the wires, and then prime it and let her buck. Yeah, we're almost there. So, quick update here. So far, everything, gasket wise, besides the exhaust manifold gaskets that came with that kit, have worked. Not sure why. They're way different, too. Not even close. Like the bolt holes aren't even the same. Whatever. Uh, O'Reilly's allegedly has some. Just go and go. Need to see if I can pick up some exhaust manifold bolt too so that I don't have to hodgepodge it and some T-wing bolts. It'd be nice to make this thing nice. Get rid of some of the fuckery of bolts that I've got going on. So yeah. But fuel line's back on. Gotta do the exhaust. All the front shit needs to go back together still. I haven't done any of that yet. Don't care to do it yet. Um, the water pump's electric so boogie woogie. I don't have to run it yet. So let's go get this. Yeah, hopefully we can get her going. She should have started up today. Already spun it over. And it didn't bend any push rods, so we're doing better than the last time. So, alright, we'll let you know how it goes. We'll show you. I will film it for the first start attempt. Hopefully it starts right up so I don't look like a dumbass. Uh, I'll probably have to tighten a few lines and stuff like that, make sure nothing's leaking, but we'll get there. Alright guys, this is all back together, except for the exhaust manifold gasket with junk, and I can't get one until tomorrow. 
so we'll probably get it started tomorrow night after work. Uh, I'm gonna pick the front of the car up, change the oil real quick, just while I'm thinking about it. Just trying to get it really close. It's got no water in it. And we have not figured out an alternator bracket yet, but I wanna get it running first before I put any more effort in this thing. Cause that water pump bracket will not be the same if it ends up getting LS or big block swapped. So let's uh, jack this thing up, do an oil change. Just kind of trying to pick up my tools as I go here. Because cleanliness is key. Coloring in boxes. Looks like fun. So hopefully we'll see you tomorrow. You gotta go ass first. What are you doing? You're gonna scalp yourself. There is a really sharp edge there. Oh my god, that's painful. That bar is painful. Dude, it is. It's necessary. You got a mosquito eating your face. Well, it started. Didn't throw any rods out yet. That's a good thing. It that's did it. sound a little it, choppier. It didn't sound bad. So we'll see. I think it was idling kind of high, but that could be. Um, actually, no, it was only about 800. Well, it might just be that cam is louder than. All right, let's well, shut this off. The it's the same exhaust. All right. All right, that's all for tonight. I got to go to work tomorrow, and then we'll time it after work. Huh? I could put them on the all oh, the Milwaukee batteries and stuff. Yeah. So we